y'all welcome back to my channel welcome to my channel if you're new it's your girl Taryn. today's video y'all it is jam-packed with all the motivation that you need i am decluttering i am cleaning i am organizing we're getting it all done let's dive right into the video y'all No, you are not having flashbacks. <laughs> we are back in the bathroom. But this time, y'all, I had to get up underneath this sink. It was a hot mess up underneath this sink. I mean, hot mess express. Yes, all of that. So we're going to go ahead and get everything all decluttered, clean, and organized up underneath this sink. Love, love, take some time to Okay, so y'all, I had every intention on just cleaning up underneath this sink, but I decided I would go ahead and remove that peeling stick that I installed a while ago. Remember I told you I was gonna be removing it. I was not supposed to be removing it today, but I decided to go ahead and remove it. So I'm gonna go ahead and bring you along while I remove the rest of it. But we still have some left. I'm gonna have to take these doors off so I can go ahead and get it removed. That's the blow dryer I'm using so that I can remove it easily and then I'll remove it from here. Okay, y'all, so it is back to the way it was. It is all brown now. This side didn't come out so good. Of course, it didn't come with these knobs on here. I'm just gonna leave the knobs on here. The reason why I'm gonna leave the knobs on here is because of the fact that I just don't feel like removing them and putting the other ones back on here. So we're just gonna leave these on here. Been stuck here in a bed for days. I've been staring at the telephone cause when you're Y'all, I still can't believe that all of this stuff came from up underneath this small sink. Like, 
it's amazing how much stuff we can just accumulate and just keep adding and keep adding. I am really working so hard, y'all, on trying to get this stuff in order. It's extremely hard because I have a mom that does not want to get rid of anything. Y'all let me know down in the comments. Do y'all have anybody that y'all deal with like that? I'm curious to know. Wanna give you up? I know we've been through way too much, but I'm confident we'll make it through. I'm here for you, you're not by yourself. Lay the clock, body talk. There's no need to bring it up. Nothing you say makes it better. Mm -hmm. Break it. Yeah, we had empties. We had some things that we haven't used in over a year or since the last time I decluttered up underneath this sink. Like we just holding on to stuff for no reason at all. I, I don't, I don't get it. I don't, I need y'all help y'all. I mean, <laughs> I'm going to need y'all to talk to mama because mama is driving me crazy. She's driving me insane with holding on to everything.
I ran away from heartbreak Got nothing in return for my pain I never thought I'd be so empty, so alone and afraid Okay, y'all, here's a quick overview of what it looks like now. So all of the cleaning products are down here. I just stuck the Clorox wipes here because we reach for those a lot. Right here houses all of like the personal things that we use in the bathroom, our like our body washes, our Dr. Teal's loofah just different things like that um epsom salt y'all y'all you know when you get a certain age honey you've been eating the soak and some epsom salt right here is where we have all of our products you know my mom and i are both natural my sister's natural as well so pretty much all of us are natural around here so these are the products that we use we, we reach for it's still probably a little bit too much i did get rid of some because it was just too much stuff up under here here are the soaps like the bath bar soap and the Listerine, the toothpaste, um, my Oral-B toothbrush refillers, just different things like that. And then the Q-tips. I don't know why we have so many Q-tips, y'all, but that's it. That's how it turned out. Wasn't looking for a lover. Wasn't Nobody understood where I've been. Yes, I thought I needed more time to protect my love from potential offense. So I then you and you but I so you and I I'm not surprised by what Trust and my fragile heart started to mend. Yeah. I should have paid attention. You would have been the obvious choice. But I needed time to see clearly, dig deep, and cut through the So y'all, I do hope that you're enjoying the video so far. If you are, please don't forget to give it a big, big thumbs up. And also, I know this video is a little bit longer than the last video was because I am covering a lot of spaces in our home. It is not the entire house, but it, was, it took me two days to get all of this done. That's because I had so much to do. So now I'm actually going to be decluttering the coat closet it's like at the front of the house in this closet is where we have to put our coats on and everything you know we have dogs so we have to walk the dogs and things like that so that's what's going on in this video and again I had 
a task with mom trying to get rid of some things. Like, she seriously won't get rid of anything, y'all. This The struggle is real over here. Y'all, she won't even let me declutter her bedroom. Like, yeah, that's how bad it is. But I told y'all on the last video that we're going to be moving soon. So I am trying my best to get things down to a minimum. To a minimum? Yeah, a minimum. <laughs> Prior to us moving, because that's less things that I have to pack. <sighs> Y'all wish me luck. It won't go away. I've got that feeling rushing through my body. I know that it is here to stay. It's like you're my personal Illuminati. I know that some might say that I am just a bad girl. But if you treat me right. on your body so tell me tell me what you want me to do i can be good or be not it So y'all, the pullover sweats, those are raging Cajuns. That is where my son graduated from college, y'all, Louisiana. Anyway, so my mom thought that I was throwing those away or actually donating them. Ooh, y'all, it was a whole situation. <laughs> like, I'm like, no, I was just taking them out of the closet, trying to make sure that I declutter it. Now, there are a couple of jackets here that you see right here that I want to get rid of. Oh, no, ma'am. Couldn't do that. No. It... <laughs> I'm like, what is really going on here? What is really going on? We can't wear them. We haven't worn them in over a year. Y'all, we have to let things go. We have to let them go. Like, seriously. Yeah, 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 yeah. Bad little flex, she wanna know me. I stay low key, y'all gas, no breaks, baby. Let them hoes sleep. Body on to make your girl OD. I get in my way, never out of my lane. Feel like you the 
one and I'm on one. So what is gonna be? Baby squad up, we finna go deep. Is you riding on a team? Got what you need. Baby, won't you keep me company? Give me something to do when I get lonely. I got something for you when we get home. If you let me put it down, when I hit the town, you should ride on me. Keep your minds on me. On try, baby, I think you should side with me. Stay solid one time if you lie with me. Promise you never lie to me. Keep the moves on tuck. I know it's all love. Everything good. Keep the vibes on crush. I know it's all good. Know it's all love. Know it's all love. I've been feeling like I'm feeling like a man lately. Can't nobody do it like I can daily. Fattest in the lattice in the lane. To a fan up, fan up. I made it where I'm at on my own. Had a couple blocks in the road, but I get to the bag on the loan. I pick down the stacks while they grow, yeah, you know me. Baby, won't you keep me company? Give me something to do when I get lonely. I got something for you when we get home. If you let me put it down, when I come in town, you should lie on me. Keep your minds on me. On try, baby, I think you should side with me. Stay solid one time if you lie with me. Just promise you never lie to me. Keep the moves on tuck. I know it's all up. Everything good. Keep the vibes on crush. I know it's all good. Good. Know it's all love. So y'all, what's a video without seeing Mr. Carmelo make his appearance? I mean, I think you think this is his YouTube channel. However, I have news for him. It is not his YouTube channel. Getting love from my city, yeah. I roll call for the DMV. In my own lane, you could still ride with me, yeah. No one knows I made mistakes. You won't end, but it's too late. I don't need your support just to know I'm important. I won't ever sell myself short, cause I know you'll see me on the come up. Big girl with big dreams and big drips. Talk is cheap, but please damn me. So y'all we've made it to my filthy bedroom okay no judgment zone no judgment yes it's a mess i know it's a mess that's why i'm cleaning it up <laughs> 
I'm telling y'all, y'all are going to get some motivation here. If you haven't gotten it already, you have to get some motivation because this room here, it was a mess. And I'm going to get in my closet, y'all. Oh, and I'm going to keep it clean. I'm going to keep it clean. Now, I know y'all see that Lysol and I sound a little congested. Well, that's because I always sound congested these days. If y'all not using that Lysol, y'all better start back pulling out that Lysol, y'all. We have to continue to sanitize, sanitize, disinfect, sanitize, disinfect. We have to do it because that's the only way we're going to keep these germs down. We have to do it, y'all. Also, I want to tell y'all, you see that I'm making my bed up first. The reason I'm doing this is because whenever you need motivation, the first thing you need to do, especially in your bedroom, is make your bed up. It does make you feel better. I know I struggle with this, y'all. So if you struggle with it, I totally get it. But I do struggle with this. I am going to try my best to start getting up in the morning and making my bed up. So at least it will help my day start out good. And it'll motivate me to just continue to keep my room clean and keep it in order. I mean, this makes no sense that my room gets this bad. But I'm working on it, y'all. I'm always a work in progress. Always. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? It's the end of the weekend, but I still wanna turn up. Yeah, I still wanna turn up. All I want is to go again. But you ain't picking your phone up Why you messing my head up? Any night, any day Let me take you away All I need is just saying yeah, 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 yeah Better nights, better days When you're here with me, babe Cause you're all that I crave So I wonder Where are you? Where are you? Don't hide away from me when I need you most. We got love guaranteed, and I have to know. Say, where are you? Where are you? Don't be so hard to reach. Just pick up your phone. Tell me where you'll be, cause I gotta know. Let me know when you're ready. Cause I made reservations Too many invitations And the last night was heavy. heavy I need communication Tell me where's your location Used to talk 24-7 Every other second Just to make sure we were up to date Now it's closer to 11 And I ain't hearing nothing I just need to know that you're okay And I have to know, say, where are you? Where, where are you? Where, where are you? Hey. Don't be so hard to reach. Just pick up your phone. Tell me where you'll be, cause I gotta know. Any night, any day, let me take you away. All I need is you saying, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Better nights, better days. When you're here with me, babe, cause you're all I crave, so I wonder. Where are you? Where, where are you? Where are you? Baby, don't hide away from me when I need you most. We got love guaranteed, and I have to know, say. so hard to reach just pick up your phone tell me where you'll be because i gotta know oh, it was so dusty in my room this lamp right here this lampshade it was full of dust yeah it was dust everywhere like it was flying all in my face i was sneezing i'm surprised y'all don't see all of that on the video it's just some good editing though just some good editing <laughs> 
So y'all, I know y'all probably like, oh, she is so chatty <laughs> in this video. Well, I am because I told y'all the one thing that we have to do when we're actually a content creator, we have to have fun with it. If you are not having fun with it, y'all, you're going to have to find something else to do. I'm just going to be honest with you. Maybe you need to take a break. That's what I had to do because I was not having fun anymore. I feel like you should really be having fun. You should be enjoying what you're doing. You should be able to laugh. You should be able to smile. You should be able to talk to your subscribers. I mean, y'all know I love y'all, but I still have to have fun. Like, we have to have fun with this. I want you to come over to my channel, and I want you to be able to smile and be able to laugh, and I want to motivate you all at the same time to get up and get some things done around your home. Because I know how hard it can be, and I know how it is when you just have so much outside noise going on inside your head that it makes it a little difficult to get up and get your stay, get your stuff together and get your day started. That's why I encourage you to start with at least just one small task. If it's something as small as just making your bed up. And then you will begin to find your rhythm. And you will begin to find yourself again and be able to have fun with cleaning. Because we have to do it. That's the only way it's going to get done, right? <laughs> so therefore, at least if you're having fun while you're doing it, then it makes more sense. And then you get to look back and see how nice everything looks and you just get to enjoy it. Like right now I'm sitting in my bedroom and it is such, it feels so good to have a clean room, y'all. It really does. And then opening up my closet door. Oh, you just wait. Y'all just wait. Y'all gonna get, we're gonna get there shortly. We're gonna get there. Y'all sound like dust? Yes, it was a lot of dust. And you know, dust accumulates. It just accumulates daily. It's not, it doesn't matter how much you clean or how much you don't clean, dust accumulates. That's just the way it is. One step forward, two steps backwards, yeah. And much your lover who don't use big words, yeah. I don't need convincing at all because I know what I want Baby, can't you figure it out what's going on in your heart? What's it gonna take for you to love, take for you to love me? What's it gonna take for you to show, take for you to show feels? Yeah. I've been trying to take it slow, but my patience low Think it's time you let me know Come 
dancing at all because I know what I want. Mm -hmm. Baby, dig deep. It's time to make a move on my heart. What's it gonna take for you to love, take for you to love me? So y'all, I used to keep all of my shoes in shoe boxes, but to cut down on space, because I have such a small space now, I got a, got rid of some of my shoe boxes. I didn't get rid of all of them, but I did get rid of most of them. And that does help a lot. So if, you're, if your storage space is pretty small, then, and you are keeping your shoe boxes, I would say try to get rid of those because that will help a lot. Also, as far as clothing, I did do a huge declutter in my closet. So I get, got rid of a lot of clothes that I was not wearing any longer. And I will tell you, I don't miss them at all because they were just taking up space. I was not wearing them. However, I will say to you that when it comes down to just holding on to stuff, like, Again, y'all, we have to learn to let go of things. We can't just keep holding on to everything because all it's doing is just taking up space. And I don't know about y'all, but when I have clutter and stuff everywhere, it does something to me mentally. Like it really does. It affects me because I can't function. I'm just so crowded by so much stuff and overwhelmed by so many things going on. So I'm going to have to do a declutter of my shoes because I have a lot of shoes now that because I haven't decluttered shoes in a while. So I'm going to have to do that like I did my clothes. And I also contemplated getting rid of this because it's starting to get on my nerves too. But I have stuff in there and I need to declutter it and clean it out first. But yeah, for now, we're going to go ahead and hold on to it.
decided to go ahead and organize my closet just a little bit better I don't have a lot of clothes anymore so it's a lot easier to go ahead and organize it and when I was looking at the pants and you'll see I'll get to that shortly where I'm gonna go ahead and switch those pants up and jeans and just put them color coordinated and also place them on a hanger the proper way that I like to hang my pants and y'all, I have been enjoying my graphic tees. So it is Black History Month. So you know, you can see here, just in case you were wondering that I am wearing the Black Beautiful Proud t-shirt that I purchased from Target. Also, last week's video, I rocked her shirt. So you're gonna see me rocking a lot more of these graphic tees, not only for the rest of this month, but for a while because why? Because I want to. <laughs> and I love graphic tees. I'm really into graphic tees now. And they're very comfortable to clean in. I just have to stay away from the bleach, y'all, because some of them are black. Yeah, I need to stay away from the bleach. Fool me once, fool me twice. When you're hiding things, might as well be lies. Can you I'm outside, yeah. waiting by the curb. Too upset to drive, you yeah. getting on my nerves. We gon' get lit on this ride. I look too good to fight. Don't expect me to come home tonight. Don't worry about me, see you in the morning. But you never thought that I would leave. Think I had about enough. I mean, hold up, you could call me on my bluff. I ain't coming to wait. The video is nearing the end. Thank you so much for spending some of your precious time with me. I definitely do appreciate it so, so much. Words cannot explain how much I appreciate you spending that time with me. Also, if you have not yet subscribed to my channel, please go ahead and do so. Don't forget to like, and I will see y'all in the next video. I love each and every one of you to the moon and back. Bye y'all. Don't wait up